What's going on guys? Uh, my name's Aaron and uh, I'm sure you weren't expecting this. <laughs> uh, so I recorded episode 7, uh, the intro of the Pokemon Pearl Randomizer Nuzlocke, so I hope you guys enjoy that. Um, but the reason why I'm recording this for you guys, I kind of went off on a tangent. Um, the beginning of the video sounded a little depressing. I think I finally reached the point where quarantine is starting to get to me, and of course it's when I'm actually enjoying doing something and uh, preoccupying my time. And uh, also the audio, I just want to make you fully aware, in the video is, is a little off. Um, I, I don't know if you can see, but it's a pretty big open room, and I record right there on the floor. I don't even have a chair, it's just like at coffee table height. Um, but yeah, I wanted to re-record that intro for you guys because it sounded pretty depressing and, you know, I want you guys to enjoy the video. I don't want you guys to feel bad for me or anything like that. Um, but basically I was just going over that, you know, each video that comes out, you guys might notice some differences in the videos or the thumbnails or the layouts and I'm putting a lot of work into those. And this whole series is basically a work in progress and it's, it's my own little project that I can be proud of. And uh, I just, I'm such a perfectionist that I, I don't know, I feel like uh, basically what I'm trying to get at is I just want you guys to know that I care and I'm, I'm putting work into it. And I, based on you guys' comments and, and supports, you know, I, you know, I just, I just felt so insignificant, but because of all you guys' love, it's really reassuring that not only can I enjoy doing this, which I absolutely love recording Pokemon, um, but you guys make make it even better. So thank you so much. I also had realized that I have not been answering the questions of the day because that was a new incorporation again for the for this whole project. Um, but so the first question, how do I feel about the uh, Pokemon? What is it? How do I feel about the sprites and the layout? I think it turned out great. It took me a lot of finagling, it took me a lot of work, a lot of research, um, but I'm loving how everything turned out. And my favorite Pokemon, which I believe was the question in the last episode, is Electivire. I based my channel off Hitmonchan, but I think it's a tight race between Hitmonchan and Electivire, and I think Electivire slightly edges it out, but Hitmon Aaron sounds a lot better than e e Electivirin? Electivirin? So, uh, <laughs> so yeah. Um, I do hope you guys continue to enjoy. Again, sorry about this abrupt intro. Um, and I'm sorry about the abrupt connection to the Pokemon randomized Nuzlocke, uh, but I hope you guys enjoy. So here we go. But in today's video, we're going to finally get through Eterna Forest, okay? Um, after we get through Eterna Forest with Cheryl, we should be in Eterna City. I'm hoping to maybe challenge the gym leader in this episode, maybe get a new encounter, which by the way, guys, we have to go over a team recap. Starting with Attila here, he is our poison fighting type bra. Uh, he has the plus ability, again, that's never gonna help us. He has Astonish, Mudslap, Pursuit, and x Scissor, which has done us wonders. Next we have Laudrin, we met him at level 7. He has a flash fire ability with Hidden Power, Uproar, Astonish, and Howl. Next we got Tom with the Reckless ability. Fake Out, Scratch, Astonish, and Nightshade, and he has been the clutch of our team so far throughout the uh, playthrough. Next we have Gamer, who we caught last episode with the Snow Cloak ability. He has Lick, Tail Whip, Charm, and Bite, and in the end of the last episode, we got a true team player on the team. Uh, it is a Chimera with the Damp ability, prevents combatants from self-destructing, which is the only really good ability that we've got. Uh, he has Sonic Boom, Sand Attack, Faint Attack, and Sand Tomb, and I didn't bother grinding him up. I mean, he's fairly close, and I figured if we lost him, which, knock on wood, I hope we don't. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, got a pretty split, even up team right here. I don't know if this is a trainer. Nah, so we should be good. Uh, again, we've already gotten our encounter, but let's see what else we could have caught in anyway. I think all these are going to be double battles. Ugh. I mean, I like Flygon. I really like Flygon. Um, Lapras would have been great. And let's and let's face it, nobody wanted an Aerodose. <laughs> but um, yeah, Lapras would have been cool. I, I'm gonna try not to bum myself out about that because where's the fun in that? 
found a metronome. So, uh, actually, so with Laudrin, with him having uproar, because metro metro <laughs> metronome powers up moves in the same uh, in the same row. Is that right? Yeah. Uh, a Pokemon held a Pokemon hold item <laughs> that boosts a move used consecutively. Yeah, so we're gonna put this on Loudrin uh, because that should power up Stab Uproar. Wait, wait, uh, that's gonna be good. <laughs> it's gonna be good. Oh, Claydol would have been real cool too. I really like Claydol. There's a lot of good encounters in this forest. I mean, as long as we didn't get the Airy Dose. Oh, plus there was also a Rabidash, so that's great. That's, I, I'll take it, I'll take it. Um, you know, I do want to put Flygon out front. I mean, the Mons in the forests are what, like between levels 10 and 12? So any trainers that we get should be pretty good experience for Flygon. By the way, guys, um, you know, if I sound more chill this episode, I don't know. Um, you know, sometimes I personify my voice <laughs> for for the entertainment, um, but I'm gonna keep moving and chatting, multitasking. Uh, but yeah, I, I try to persona personify my voice uh, so you guys can really enjoy. But I, I just like to think, take things calm and chill. But if something wacky happens, you know, I, I mean, I'm a, I'm a wacky guy. I'm a goof, you know. <laughs> oh, by the way, I didn't realize how close Chimchar and Chimera's name was to each other. <laughs> All right, guys. So. Challenge, oh, a double battle, uh, hello. I mean, I, I, I'm with Cheryl, what did I expect? What's cool, you might ask? No, I'll tell you anyway, bug Pokemon, you're probably not gonna even have a bug Pokemon, bruh. All right, let's see it. We're just out on a power walk. Sweet, great, that's freaking sick. You're challenged by Bugcatcher Crystal and Last Marshall. Bugcatcher Crystal sent out Phoebus, Lamau, and Kyogre. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, that's no bueno, because we just put out Flygon. Oh, and he's... Oh. And he's level 14. What the... F <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, you know, guys, let's let's throw in the Loud Red. <laughs> and uh, let's see how this uh, stab upper goes. Water Pulse. Attack the Chimchar. Hey, thanks. <laughs> thanks, mate. <laughs> Uh, but Chimchar is probably going to go down here. And does Cheryl have any other Pokemon? She didn't when we were... Splash, Lamau. <laughs> she didn't when we uh, were challenging... Oh, she doesn't. I was going to say, she didn't when Chimchar fainted to Flygon when we were catching. The only thing with Upper is that... Uh, oh, I didn't set a timer. <laughs> the only thing with uproar is that I'm gonna be locked into that, but I am four levels higher. But stab water pulse from a Kyogre wouldn't be good, and I don't really want to go into Tom because he's already over leveled. So I think, guys, I think Loudrin's our best bet. That that boosts attack, so Hal's not gonna do us any good. I'm just gonna uproar, hope that it hits. I'm gonna hope that it hits the Kyogre. Uh, no, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, please attack the Kyogre. No. No, guys. We can't start this episode like this. Wait, no, he doesn't have the Quick Claw anymore. All right, okay. Did I get any special defense? I got a pump one in special defense. Oh, and I didn't even see how many more Pokemon they had. Slack off is fine though, right? Oh God, please by some miracle, don't use water. Don't, no, no, guys, no, 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 no. Oh, oh God, I, oh God, but the Slack off. Why are you attacking the Slack off? Oh no. Calm down, Loudrin. Calm down. Don't. Don't. No. No. Guys. And Togetic. No. No. Just don't. Guys, God, 
all you had to do, you were boosted with the metronome, and you just had to hit Kyogre. It would have been Stab. No, guys. I feel so defeated. You know, there's there's nothing we can do now. I, di I didn't want to go into Sableye, because he was already tough in a special defense. It's probably great. Just... And it's funny. Like, a few days ago, I'm just like, oh, <laughs> we're not gonna lose any Pokemon. I swear to God. <sighs> it's fine. I'm hoping we can just end it with Tom. 21 damage. Fucking hell, man. God, why is this Kyogre so fast? I get it's a legendary, but he's... That's fine. Just don't confuse me. Oh. That was... That was uh, guys, it was a dumb move. I shouldn't have locked myself. Does this put me to sleep? Or confuse me? God, now we have to worry about a water pulse. Well, I don't think Tokitik can hit me, right? It's level 13. It probably doesn't know any flying type moves yet. I don't... Water Pulse still wouldn't kill me. I just... I want to take out this Kyogre. Because here's the thing. If I get hit with the Water Pulse, as long as it's not a crit... No! Tom! No! 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 Oh my god. Oh... You did... He just had to crit. He just... I don't th Oh my... God. <sighs> we lost our two aces on the team. Tom was the carry. Laudrin had stab uproar with metronome. That's what I get for not nicknabbing Laudrin and just not believing in Tom. Chimera can't do anything. In Gamer, it doesn't really have any good moves, so the only potential person we can go into is Toxicroak, and he has great speed. Grimble has a Quick Claw, but like, what, what's what's your speed? 18. 8 frickin' 10. 32. Well, until there's a breast bed. That's all we can do. And Togetek has yet to attack. So is it, what's it gonna do? Oh, and that's great. It can't do anything. I, I, I mean, I guess, he, thank God he's faster. No, come on, guys. Now you use Scary Face, and you miss. I swear to God. Avalanche, that should be fine, right? Thank God. I'm not happy. <laughs> I uh, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> That's great, Chimera. That's great. Two team members. Within like what five minutes? Not even. And you charm now. That's great. Attack hurts you fell. What the, what what do I even do? That's bug isn't gonna do I think I can only what hit it with pursuit? I think. It's special. <sighs> no, and no, and we have to worry about metronome. Level like this? That puts me to sleep. Oh my god, guys. Oh, what are these? What even are these? Testo? I'm already drained. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> I think part of me does want to cry. What is going on now? Stockpile? That's great. That's just great. That's just great. So your defense. You know what, guys? I hate to do it. I really do. Yeah, block. I can't heal. That's fine, I guess. Ice ball, miss. Charm. Um, pursuit now, I guess. Charm. You know, I'd rather him... Oh god, oh god, oh god. 
Okay. No. That's fine. I d I'm gonna keep going until Sweet Kiss. I can't risk that. I mean, well, he has lowered my attack. Uh, he has lowered my attack. Um, so even if I do hit myself, confusion shouldn't do much. Oh, uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. I, I only have 20 HP. Um, if he hits me with Dragon Rage, I'm dead. So, I can't risk that. Uh, here, enjoy this. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Uh, I don't think we're challenging the gem later this episode. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, God. Roar of Time? Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. And I snap out of confusion. You miss. And you finally crit. Not even... Don't even gain a level from that. You know what, guys? You know what? I... I... Uh, will be back. I'm gonna be doing the time lapse. And, uh... You'll see me... Yeah. You'll, you'll see me put them in the box. But, uh... I gotta... I gotta do some grinding at this point. So, I'll be right back. A few moments later. All right, guys, so we're back. And after an intense grinding session, uh, we finally made it to the box or the PC, if you want. And uh, who do we... Nope. Loudred, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You didn't even get... You didn't even get a chance to be nicknamed. And uh, sadly, buddy, I'm going to have to take that, that metronome from you. And Tom, there is absolutely no excuse. I should have sent you in first, or sent you in first, rather. I can't even speak English. <sighs> Tom, in the future, I will never doubt you again. Okay? You did so much for us, and I thought we were going to take you to the end. And I'm sorry to anybody else that thought we were going to as well. So, two really tough boys. Gone. All right, so guys, um, I did do, you know, as you as you know, a grinding session. Got Attila, got no, no, you know what? Got everybody up to 19. I don't even know. Uh, got Attila up to 19. Uh, he did learn feint attack, I believe, at level 18. So we uh, took out pur pursuit for that uh, because feint attack can't miss, which is great. Uh, Gamer was the absolute worst to grind up because he only had bite, and he learned headbutt. At level 19. And he is super slow. So I, I guess Quick Law might come in clutch at some point. And Chimera didn't learn anything. And guys, uh, Sand Tomb, I get it only has 15 power. But my special attack is better than my physical attack. God, I hope we never have to use Sand Tomb. It's that bad. By the way, something that I realized, which I don't know why I did it. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, so we're actually going to give the metronome... In place of the black belt to Attila, because black belt, yes, while it does uh, increase fighting type moves or the power of fighting type moves, yeah, Attila doesn't have any. So why not even give that to him? I don't know. I really don't know. Um, and I guess I don't know. I guess Flygon or Chimera, whatever the name is anymore, needs a freaking item as well. So it's an ordinary. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not too <laughs> thrilled. <laughs> But it is what it is, guys. I mean, if we had to lose two team members, I guess... You know, Loudrum wasn't going to evolve into level 40, but not gonna lie, I was really looking forward to the stab upper with the metronome. Oh, yeah. Coulda, coulda got a Beedrill on this route. And you wanna know something else? You wanna know something else? We had to grind out on this route with Voltorbs, Stantlers, Beedrills, and Granbulls. Okay? Yeah, you know all those tough bonds in the forest? Yeah, I didn't want to go back and forth between Cheryl being like, where are you going? And, oh, welcome back, let me check up with you. I didn't want to go through all of that. Plus, healing was right here. So grinding took a little while. But again, guys, if we had to lose two mons, I guess those were the two. Uh, we are going to give Chimera some love. By the way, I initially ground everybody to level 18. But I was just like, well, if Tom... Went down level 21 against the Kyogre. Yes, Cheryl. Yes. Oh, oh, hi, Aaron. I've been waiting like I said. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yes. Fun, fun music. Um, but yeah, guys, I, I, you know, I thought 18 was perfect, but 
God forbid if the trainers had clay dolls and lapras at level what? 16? At level 15? I who's who's taking that hit? Who's taking that hit? Yeah, I can tell you, no one. Maybe Toxic Group. By the way, I wanted to check on something else, guys. I don't think I went over Flygon stats. So overall, pretty decent around. Attack is kind of bleh and special defense, but everything else is really good. And plus, I mean, with Loudrin and, uh, yeah, I, uh, I keep wanting to say them by their nicknames, but Loudrin didn't have one. <laughs> yeah, oh, and the guys, I hate Kyogre. But yeah, I want to keep calling them by their nicknames, but Loudrin didn't have one. <laughs> oh, look at that. Of all the items in the game we could get, we got another quick claw. <laughs> God forbid, guys. This, you know, this might be the end. This might be the end. Um... God, I, you know what? I said I was getting Chimera with some love. Here's the love, Chimera, whatever. I see it, I see it. I see you going down and defeat God. <laughs> I hope not. When a trainer in Pokemon Bond is one, a wondrous power is born. I guess that power wasn't strong enough for me and Tom. Loudrin, I mean, you know, but Tom. Drop it. Yeah, I don't know what Flygon's level up moveset's like. Um, I'll, I will definitely have to be looking into that right there. Okay, so... Not looking too good for Flygon. So at level 25, it was supposed to learn Santim, which it does, which I guess is good. Level 33, he learned Supersonic. But at level 35 is when he learns Dragon Breath. And then level 45 is Dragon Claw. He, he can learn a lot of TMs, but it's just a matter of finding said TMs, so... Looks like this is gonna be the moveset for a while. Drop it! Yeah. Oh, there's the exit. I'm so relieved. We finally got here. I would never have been able to get through this by myself. Thank you so much, Aaron. Yeah, I was gonna say what you're gonna give me, but you did give me heals, and you did come through clutch. Wait, hold the phone. Oh, hold the phone. This can't be a new route, right? Now, sad, sad but true. So, let's see, there's probably an item up here. Oh, there's some berries. Oh, I guess I was wrong, by the way. I think I said in the one video that there's only one honey tree. Yeah, no, there's multiple. Uh, oh, that's a lot of... Oh, that's a lot of trainers. I'm assuming... No hidden... No hidden item? Oh, wait, what's down here? What's over here? Oh, wait, that's the cut, right? Oh, yeah. Wait, what's over there, though? I scram. Just scram. I scram. Um... Um... No, look, I'm just like one of them. <laughs> um... I'll come back and fight these guys maybe off-screen. I really don't think I need to do it right now. Oh, hello! By the way, guys, if you guys... Oh, that's a Galactic Run. Hey, what's up? Uh, bruh... But I'm, I'm healed, right? Yeah, I'm good. So, if he wants to fight in the middle of this town, so be it. Hey, you! Yeah, you trainer! Uh, it's okay, never mind, you look tough. Uh, I won't, um... I'll just let you carry on. Yeah, that's right, bro. Be real scared. My friend said Team Galactic. Oh, Team Galactic? Oh my god, those sucks. Oh my god, whoa, whoa. Scrim. Uh, turn to city. I don't- oh yeah, I don't know if I even finished my sentence. Uh, let me know in the comments if there's some items that I should be getting in the town. Oh! Alright, well hello, can I- Okay, so I can pass you. Why are you there though? Going underground with an explorer's kit. Oh, okay. So, hey, long time no see. You look puzzled. You're wondering who I am. I'm one of Professor Roan's assistants. I'm Professor Roan's assistant and Don's father. Ooh, uh, nutty. I've come a long way to help you on your adventure at the professor's behest. I mean, Pokemon, have you met 100, 106? Jeez. Uh, yes, bravo! Here's something for you. Uh, ow! Ow! And I think we get a new... What? Ha! Huh. Oh, it's the cycling road, so... I, I don't even think I can get an encounter on the cycle, of course. Uh, Gardenia. Ooh, Master of Vigit Prime Pokemon. Ha-ha! Ha-ha! 
Since Team Galactic's building went up, the city's atmosphere has gotten all creepy and tense. Ooh. Ooh, you need a massage. Wait, how do I... Oh, the... Of course. We have Master Ball or TM? Magnet, that'll be good if we get some mods with electric moves. I I know I said, guys, I know I said, I know what I said, damn it, about letting me know what's in the town. I'll do it in the next episode, I swear, but what's this? Oh, hey, 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 whoa, 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 is this where I get the Explorer's Kit? Let's take out some treasure, tre treasure, treasure, cat. Oh, wait, a little, Oh god, I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I did it again, I did it again. <laughs> okay, so, I mean, we could farm some more fossils, but I don't think we're gonna do any of the underground stuff, guys. Um, the underground man. <gasps> I'll make a gift for you! Wait, I'll make a gift of this to you. You hold your end of the deal and put it to good use. So I did get the Explorer's Kit. So, I don't think I had to do any uh, tutorial. But yeah, we're not going to do any of the underground stuff, because if I'm not mistaken... Oh, wait. Sorry. Oh, he's so lonely because it said, no, I'm not going to do the underground tunnels. Um, so, guys, do I go back to Orberg and see now that we got the Explorer's Kit? Or do I have to do this tutorial? All right, I'm going to make a quick cut, because if we can get another encounter and slap the experience share on it, guys, especially if it's a little leap, because that would be very nice, then I will be... Ugh, I'll be right back again. <laughs> All right, guys, so I decided against it. I didn't mean for this to happen. Oh, is that a Pokedex? You must be helping Professor Roan. What's your name? Okay, hello, Arian. I'll be sure to remember that name. My name is Cynthia. I'm a trainer just like you. Been studying Pokemon myth uh, mythology lately, just out of curiosity. Here I am in Eterna City. There's a statue of an ancient Pokemon. According to myth, it was an extremely powerful Pokemon. Who knows, you may encounter something like that while you're traveling along with your Pokedex. Try using this, it should help you on your way. Hey, we have a cut now, um, but we can't use it until we defeat the gym leader. Remember, the hidden move cut can be used in the field. It will let you go places that were previously inaccessible to you. That's important for filling up your Pokedex, right? Then luck be with you, young trainer. God, I gave Cynthia such a boring, <laughs> such a very boring uh, 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 accent, uh, voiceover. Uh, but anyhow, guys, uh, I lied. Um, I figured we'll start next episode with going all the way back. Um, you know, to see if we can finally get the fossil Pokemon. I didn't mean for that interaction to happen. Um, I just figured it'll make next video a little <laughs> spicy. A little spicy. Um, also, off screen, I will uh, I will do this Explorer's Kit tutorial. Uh, God forbid, just in case we do need to do it before we can give the fossil to the guy in the Warburg. So, considering we don't have a bike, I'm gonna go to the bike shop real quick to see if there's something we need to do. Obviously, there is something we need to do. I think we have to battle the gym leader first, and then maybe we'll get a voucher, but let's pop our heads in the shop. The shappy shop. I wish you won't. Manager's gone off to, oh, so, okay, so, the Team of Galactic's building is north of Eterna, so we have to get cut first to get in there, which you won't. Have you seen our building? Team Galactic is so stinking rich that we have one, that oh, we can have one built instantly. My apologies. Okay, so since we beat all those bras, what's this? Condominiums? Oh, condominiums might be good. It might be a good time. Hey, yeah, I need potion. I need them potions. I need them potions. A uh, nice even six. A uh, nice even six. By the way, last episode, I bought one repel. Yeah, that don't work for me, Chief. It needs to be a nice even number. Nambere. So, I think what we're going to do, and then maybe end the video, we're gonna go in here and check out the levels. We're leaving with Attila, that's what I wanted. Uh, I'm gonna check out the levels of the base leaders. What's this? Hey there, how's it going? Champ to be? Actually, that's what I wanted to say. Some boy who zipped in here earlier too. The gym leader, Gardena, is a user of grass-type Pokemon. Should be obvious, but grass-type Pokemon really hate fire. Oh wait, on second, I should tell you about the gym itself first. You can't challenge a gym leader until you find and beat all the gym's trainers. Oh, okay. Uh, it's a bit challenging, but just think of it as good training. Go for it. Hello, Gardenia. Gar Gardenia. 
<laughs> I'd bite you. Well, wait. Cool accent time, but female. Hmm. That's my gym, and no one gets to battle the gym leader, me, until they've beaten all the other trainers. I'll be waiting for you in the back. Good luck, challenge, huh? I will, for sure, forget the accent by the time I get to Gardenia. What do I do here? Did I do anything with these, bruh? Bruh? I think, what, can't be, can some of these people be trainers? I think that's what it turns into, unless it's just all like a big old maze. Oh wait, yeah, she's... Yeah, yeah, I think I gotta find the people. How did you know where to find me? Let's have her battle! Well, bruh, why are you staring at a tree? Can we talk about that? Challenge my last Robin. Send out Wobbuffet. Ugh. Ugh, yeah, cuz... I should be faster, cuz AM5 levels above, okay. And that is super effective, and not stab, but high crit ratio, oh god, don't destiny bond. Mirror coat, I'll get wrecked, get destroyed. It was a physical attack, bruh, faint attack. Yeah, I, I, I honestly think that if we lose Attila, that's, you, I, you know, not, not discrediting Gamer, or, uh, you know, or uh, Chimera, I already forgot the name, slacking. Well, I gotta keep battling. The only good thing is, cause slacking stats are, are I believe, in, even better than like half the legendaries. And he has pressure, which, uh, what, uh, what are the odds? What are the odds? Cause most legendaries have the pressure ability. Oh wait, oh, Exorcist's not stacked cause I was an idiot and used faint attack. Oh, oh, bruh. Mwah. Mwah. Oh, that mm, Italian kiss. Mwah. Thank you for the encore. You just, you just boosting your demise, kid. Let's see how much this. Wait. Why didn't that didn't do more? Why did that not? This should still take it out. Is it sound moves? Is Metro wait? Is Metronome sound moves? Because I'll look like a real freaking dunce. I'll look like a real freaking dunce sparse. Okay, bruh, if it's just for sound moves, because that, now that I think about it, makes complete sense. Have I been a, oh, uh, oh, uh, have I been a, have I done the thing? Have I, have I, have I, did I do the thing? Did I goof? Did I goof the boof? A Pokemon that boosts, that boosts a move used consecutively. Its effect is reset. <laughs> no. What? A Pokemon that boosts a move if you... Yeah. So... Why did x Scissor like, do the same amount? Maybe it's just not a big, like, percentage buff that that happens. Uh, so the next trainer is down by two boulders, bruh. My Grass-type Pokemon can dole out some serious special attacks. I won't let you win. Ah, <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Easily. Bruh. You were challenged by a Roman lady, Malcolm. Hey, I like the name Malcolm. Pidgeotto, that's not the best. And it's level 14. Do we... Do we do it? Do we get... Gamer, you're not ready. <laughs> I hate to do it, Gamer, but I just... I don't think you're 100%. Yeah, tackle... I, I could have eaten that. Probably gonna stacked up X-Scissor or a faint attack or something. Oh, I already forgot about the leftovers. Bruh, tackle who? Tackle who? Sonic Boom is just all reliable. <sighs> Don't want to talk about it. Don't want to talk about it. And I can't hit him with faint attack because that's dark. Wait, is that how that works? Guys, I'm losing it. Gust. Uh, uh, oh, Gust who? Gust who? I do just want to take out this Pidgeotto. Thank goodness. I, I must speed this up, guys. Oh, 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 left, 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 num, num, num. Num, num, oh, thank you, Sonic Boom. I don't know if Sonic Boom's accuracy is 100%. However, however, Leftovers is, Leftovers mwah, is. This is gonna be Ursula. You know what? Gamer, I said you weren't ready, bro. Bro, what am I talking about? You always ready. You always ready. I do feel like this episode has gone on for a little while. But I sure, after the gym, 
Uh, this episode is a Dunzo. Garbanzo Dunzo Beans. Oh god, I'm glad I'm speeding up now. Uh, headbutt. Stab. Oh, and a flinch. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh. Oh, get destroyed. That was just gonna take a while. That was just gonna take a while. You wanna hit level 20? <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, that's... Oh, Attila's gonna get destroyed. Um... Well, Grand Bull's gonna... Gamer's gonna get destroyed, too. I have a flag on. You wanna... You wanna... You wanna show him? You wanna show this... Just... <laughs> you wanna show this, uh... Mewtwo? Up <laughs> on this Mewtwo spot? I am petrified? Wait. I don't know my types, but if I'm not mistaken... If I'm not mistaken... Oh! Uh, oh! Uh, oh! Uh, <laughs> just don't do something crazy! Kinda scared. Level 13 Mewtwo. Oh, what do what am I? Oh, what am I? Mewtwo. 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 <laughs> and fan attack can never miss. <laughs> not gonna lie. Not gonna. I was kind of scared. I was a little scared. Okay. <laughs> Can't deny that one. <laughs> that almost makes me feel better about losing Loudred. Loudred. And Tom. But Chimera, thank you. Am I overleveled? Probably. Do I care at this specific point in time? Absolutely not. Uh, and about the next trainer. It's in the middle of three trees. Oh, bruh, I, bruh, I know. I know where them tree trees are. Them tree trees, I can't go that way. Ah, 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 ah. If my life wasn't already Confucian enough. I am Confucian, but you won't. Even when you try to conceal it, you can't hide from the aroma of flowers. Well, duh, bruh. Duh, you can hide physically, but you can't hide uh, smellily. Shop it. More like, uh, dummy. <laughs> you got him. You got him. Am I right? Am I right? Fan attack. Well, nobody cares. Shop it. More like, mm. I already did that. <laughs> Defeated by Aroma Lady Crystal. Just like your inability to conceal your abundant skill. Abundant skill. All right. Your next opponent is beside the four flowers. I'm assuming it's to the right, because I haven't been over here yet. Oh, bruh. Oh, bruh. Oh, yeah, there you are. You go. You found me. <laughs> you found me. Of course I'll battle you. I'm just trying to speed through these trainers, because, I mean, as I said in the beginning, I'm just trying to, my goal is to try to just get through the gym at this point and try to make videos like 30 minutes. Okay. Drizzle, that's good to know for future reference if we ever find a Pidgeot. Pidgeot, well, I can't touch this thing. Chimera's hurt. Gamer can't really do anything either. I mean, he could... You know what? I, maybe maybe throw out a little taily whippy whip. And then bite? Oh, great. Here we go. Here we go again. Here we go again with the Pakistan. And the rain's falling. Raindrops falling on my head. Raindrops falling on my head. I forgot how slow Gramble was. The tail whipping up. That's fine. At least we got a defense drop, and I would much rather have preferred the Flygon. But wait, we don't have... We have any... Oh, leftovers, boom. Sonic, yeah, I mean, we have Sonic Boom, but, like, that, uh, that ignores defense drops, because it just doesn't even 20. God, I wish we could do fan attack right now. Oh, oh, well, it acts like it doesn't have anything to hit me with, and I'm getting... Ha. Huh. What do we do? He has a defense drop. X scissor should be good. Toxicook's physical attack is pretty nutty. Nutty, 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 nutty. Eh, there it is. Not very effective, but the Pidgeot goes down. It goes down 280 XP. Gamer! Gamer popping off. Chimera has been popping off. Ah, oh, boo, look, look, you've preached me, girl. <laughs> Losing my mind. All right, just a gym leader. All right, guys. This is it. This is it. Mm, I I know. I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Bruh. 
The gym leader's right there. Just, just go. Just do it. Just go for it. No. 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 no, no, no. Not taking any more chances. Yes, I have potions. Do I really have all that much money? Yeah, probably. I mean, maybe now. <laughs> after battling all those trainers. Um, but in the same sense, my pee pee. <laughs> pee pee. Uh, my pee pee went down. So, oh, oh wait. Oh, don't, don't look, don't look too far into it. Okay. Don't even look too far into it. Okay. We are finally challenging a gardenia. Gardenia. And I already forgot the accent I gave to her. So, you kept me waiting. I'm a Charlotte gym leader, Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My heart was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, this will be fun to let us have our battle. Gardenia, I can see your belly button. That's disgusting. You're challenged by Leader Zoe. Leader Zoe, warm it down. Oh. Like I give a damn. <laughs> Still losing my mind. Until this is great because I mean it is funny. It is funny how she does have a grass type. So gotta give that to her, even though Wormadam is ha. <laughs> I mean I guess Wormadam's defenses are fine, but tackle, tackle. You come up, I come up in your gym. Okay, so now we can really see how boosted metronome helps. Barely. But we could have just high rolled, so I don't know. Fan attack doesn't miss, and we're faster. Boom, get destroyed. This is making me feel good. I should have kept doing Exazer. Why do I, I gotta remember. I just talked about metronome. But I mean, it doesn't really boost, it doesn't really look like it boosts all that much. But, oh my God. Wormadam. What is up with this XP? Revenge? Now, the thing with Revenge, I'm always going to move second, right? Wait, I'm talking... So, uh, Revenge isn't really ever going to work because I'm so fast. But in the same sense, I'll get rid of Astonish because Revenge still is Stab. And I think the move doubles, if I was reading right. The move's going to double... Meryl, um... Nah, sorry, Gamer. Sorry, I just... It's one I'll follow. I threw Leader Zoe right now, okay? Um, then again, Fan Attack is going to be boosted by the uh, metronome. I'm sorry I'm all over the place, but yeah, we're already so fast. Revenge isn't really going to help us, but in the odd scenario that... That's fine. In the odd scenario that we are outsped, Revenge is stab, and we'll double the power if we're hit first. So, I mean, you know, it, it is what it is. Uh, Astonish had to go at some point, so... What are you gonna do? Meryl's down. I'm hoping that her ace is not a <laughs> Kyogre. So of course it's slacking. Why wouldn't it be slacking? And, and, wait, this is her boost, right? Her boost, yeah, her ace. And it's level 22. Maybe I'm not over leveled. And it has the pressure, so my PP is gonna go down. Let's see how much revenge does. Oh wait, hang on. Is it, am I always gonna move second? Was my hunch in the beginning already right? He didn't attack me though, but stab revenge, level 22. Okay. I really hope he hits me with something. Does he only have yawn? This is boosted by adventure gnome though. Okay. What? That better not be a little Ornberry. Eh? It was a citrus berry, even better. 20 more HP. Alright, so I'm asleep. What is... Oh, no! No, I didn't mean to go into Gamer. I just wanted to check the stats. I was just smashing the button. Oh, and you're gonna heal? Oh, wait. This might be okay. Because here's what I'm thinking, guys. Tail whip. Okay? Yeah, because he's gonna yawn. If I hit him with two tail whips, and I got the quick claw, he's just gonna keep yawning. So, I'm gonna kind of risk something. Quick claw, wake up! Wake up! Okay, why, why would quick claw even activate if I couldn't wake up? Oh, faint attack. 
Uh, oh, and this is coming from really high stress. That's fine. Mm, okay, so the thing is, Gamer can eat another one. So what I'm thinking is we use... We don't have a chest, though. That's fine. We'll use our one full heal on Attila. Get him out of the sleep. Fan attack, I expect it. So, what I'm thinking... Just don't crit. Just don't crit. Okay, thank God. So what I'm thinking, he's gonna go for fan attack. That, I believe, is not super effective. Which is fine. And then that'll give us a chance. Encore, that's that's fine. So now that there's two defense drops, and I can use extras, or wait. Wait, wait, is this super effective? No, it's not. Okay, so we're good. We're, we're fine. Okay, we got two defense drops. x is our best move. We have the boost by Metronome. That's not doing as much as what I was thinking it was going to, but that's fine. That's fine. Because Metronome's just going to keep boosting it up. I'm a... I'm a... Oh, and you Encore it, bruh. You would use a Super Potion. That's fine. And guys, I think... I think... We beat... Gardenia. Oh my god. Oh my god, we did it. We did it. And Gamer, thank you for those two defense drops. You know what? You did a good. You did a good. Amazing. You're very good, aren't you? Yeah, I'm the best. Okay? I, I, well, maybe, I'm, maybe not, but you know what I mean. I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? I guess... Oh, they accent. I guess I switched... <laughs> I guess that's a measure of how you love your Pokemon. And in recognition, I provide you with this. Da, 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 da. With the Force Badge, your Pokemon can use Cut outside of battle. Yep. Ah, level 30. TM86. You can train! Grass Knot. Grass Knot? We'll be good to teach one of our Pokemon if they can learn it in the next episode. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed. I'm going to try my best to keep this right around 30 minutes. But... <sighs> F in the... F in the... I always say F in the chat. F in the comment. Or Fs, if you will, for Tom and Laldorad. It's a very sad time. I really thought, seriously thought, Tom was going to go all the way to the end with us. So... As much as that blows, guys, we still have Attilia, Attilia, Attila, we still have our Chimera, and we have Gamer. So, yeah, look forward to the next episode. Again, uploads every Wednesday and Saturday. And that is what it is. Thank you guys so much for watching all of your support. And on behalf of my family to your family, I hope you all have a great rest of your day. Thank you very much for watching.